Hey, Kerry here, Best of Us Investors. This here is a chart that shows the growth of my Best of Us Investors portfolio from 2018 till today, the 24th of uh, January. And as you can see, from 18 to 19, it grew by 29%. From 19 to 20, it grew by, uh, uh, through 20, it grew by 63, 64%. And in the first 24 days of the year, it's grown by 13.2%. If I project that out over the next, uh, through the rest of the year, it's going to be a 100% growth. And I want, I looked at it and said, what's happened? Why has this grown so substantially by almost four times over the last two and a half years? And I think I know why. And in this video, I want to share why uh, I'm having the success I am and share with you as to how you might have similar success. So stay with me. Um, I want to dig into this and, and give you the facts. Best of Us Investors presents Kerry Griegmeier. Okay. Understand, I'm a retired financial advisor. I had one of the largest financial planning firms within the Ameriprise system um, and sold it in 2005. I never made this kind of return for my clients because I practiced diversification. That's what I was taught. That's what we were required to do. Protect from the downside. Don't don't go for the big side. Go protect from the downside. So I don't diversify. Um, and this all changed basically, I guess it was in maybe July of 2019. Um, I, I went to a bachelor party and, uh, my son's brother-in-law, Jared said to me, you need to read this book. Um, it's going to really enlighten you. And, uh, I wasn't that heavily in the, the stock market at that time, but it's the accidental superpower by Peter Zeehan. And Peter, it goes into very great depth as to how our society, how our economy, the world economy grew to what it is today and how uh, political and geographical things line up. And so that was an awakening to me and said, wow, it's, it's driven by demographics. This whole economy I live in today is driven by the baby boomer generation. And so that led me to doing some more reading and it led me to uh, the big six or excuse me, the big nine. And this is a book by Amy Webb, and she goes into the details of how IBM, Alibaba, uh, Microsoft, Tencent, Apple, Baidu, uh, Facebook, Amazon, and Google <clears throat> basically control all the, the data that's available in the world for the most part. <clears throat> and they use artificial intelligence to slice and dice that data and, and profit off of it. Wow, that was an awakening. And then, or more recently, I read another book um, that really opened my eyes, and that is The Future is Faster Than You, th uh, than you Think. And what this is, is a chronicle about what's going to happen over the next 10 years as a result of technology, as a result of disruption. And that changed my total lookout. Those three books changed my total lookout on investing. And I basically said, why do I want to fool around with what happened in the past? Why don't I just learn from what happened in the past and project what's going to happen in the future and then find those stocks that are going to take me into the future. Now, a year ago, I have basically owned seven stocks. Uh, the, the big six, uh, that's the big mine minus China, um, plus Tesla. That, that was my portfolio. And it treated me well. Um, but then the pandemic came and it opened some opportunity and I was sitting on some cash and, and I bought some opportunity stocks, bought into McDonald's at its low, American Express at its low, Valero Oil at its low. And as they recovered, I sold them and made 30, 40%. And that's what gave me the 63.9% last year. So I come into this year 
<clears throat> and I say, how am I going to duplicate that? Well, again, I go to the, the future is uh, faster than you think. And I recognize that this pandemic has changed the way the world thinks and that uh, first of all, um, the biotech is going to explode with CRISPR and, and some of those things. And uh, um, uh, what is it? It's called uh, da- uh, genome sequencing. I recognize that we, rec- we realize through the, the pandemic that we have a broken supply chain. And we got to move manufacturing back to the United States, but technology is going to bring it back in the form of robotics and 3D printing. And then I recognize, like you have, that electric vehicles are going to take over and that 5G is going to be a big part of it. And now I'm recognizing that the Internet's going to change and we're going to be getting our Internet from satellites up in the sky. And that's why Jeff and and Elon are throwing all those satellites up there. So with that in mind, I started preaching that, if you will, here on, on, um, th- on YouTube. And I created a Discord um, where people gather who are interested in the things I'm interested in, the investing in the future. And that Discord now has one th- um, 15,000 members. So as a result of that, I got 15,000 people who are feeding me information and I'm feeding it back to them. And they're saying to me, hey, Kerry, we know that you're interested in 3D printing. Have you looked at this company and this company and this company? And I said, no, I hadn't, but I will. And I did. And you'll see here, uh, I have created what I call um, my exponential growth portfolio. I only allocate 10% of my portfolio, which roughly is right now about $100,000. I've got, uh, as you'll see on this chart here, um, I've got 72000 of it allocated right now. And it just, such as... Uh, Isoray is a medical robotics company, um, and then DDD 3D Systems is a uh, 3D printing company, as is uh, X1. Uh, Genome Gene is a, um, a a genome sequencing, not sequencing, but a, a CRISPR type company, and so as I have been fed information from my Discord on these stocks, I go out and buy them. And, and you'll see they range in price from a high of $10, $17. I actually bought that one, I believe, at, at about um, half of that. And, um, and, and down to, I think there's some down here in, in the matter of cents. Yeah, 27 cents. So those companies are what's driving the 13% growth in the first month of this year. Where did I get them? I got them from my Discord. What I have almost accidentally put together, and I got this, I got to give credit where credit is due, is due. Andrew, Drew, uh, built this Discord for me. And um, now I have 15,000 eyes and ears feeding me information, and then I analyze the stocks, determine whether I want to buy them, and then feed that information back to those 15,000 people. And so as I'm growing, they're growing. So now what I'm looking at and saying is, how do I make this better? And what we're working on is creating a function within the Discord where if you are a member of the Discord and you like a uh, stock up in uh, Minnesota who harvests corn and turns it into ethanol and believes that they can they can displace gasoline and clean up the atmosphere and eliminate the carbon footprint of internal combustion engines, you share that with me. I then do some research on it and come back to you and share it with everybody else and actually show you the research that I did. And I, I, I'm, I'm focusing on seeking Alpha's software to analyze stocks. So that's how that works. And, and where I think it's going is that I will look at this 100% uh, estimated return and I'll blow it out of the water. Because I know 
that as a result of the corona crisis and the virus, that we can never let that happen again. Any part of it, whether it be the supply chain or millions of people dying or our economy shutting down, we can't let it happen again. And there are going to be companies who are going to facilitate the change that's required such that it never happens again. And some of these companies are now selling for 15 cents a share. And I've got 15,000 and I will, I'll guarantee you that number will grow to 30,000 within six months. People looking, got their ear to the ground, their eyes to the forward into the future and saying, this is something we need to look at. Not, not carry, but as a team, as, as a, as a tribe, we call it a tribe and, and we're going to blow it out of the water. Just because we have eliminated diversification, which gives you the S&P annual return for 90 years is average 9%. That's, 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 the, way, that's the way your grandfather invested. <laughs> that's not the way to invest now. You look into the future. You say, what happened today and what's going to result What's going to happen as a result of it? And where do I need to invest? And you don't rely just on yourself. You got 15,000 people who are anxious to feed you information. You got another group of people who are anxious to teach you how to analyze the, the value of, of the stocks. Now, I just did a video yesterday where I, I learned over the last week how, where, where the wolves of Wall Street now hide, where the pump and dump and how it works. And, and, and it, it, it was eye opening to me. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's a, it's the quickest way in the world to get filthy rich is to engineer a pump and dump. And it's now become an element of YouTube. You have influencers on YouTube now who can say to you, hey, I've interviewed this company, I've and, 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 and you can see it. The stocks just start climbing, but they have never made any money. And you go and you look at their, their filings and they don't have any employees. Oh, they may have some subcontractors that they asked to do some work for them. And, and they, they, they've never shown any profit but their price has tripled in the last three weeks. And then you dig a little deeper and you find out that they just quadrupled the number of shares they have out there so that they can issue more shares to drive the price of their stock up even higher. And even though they diluted the share count or the number of the, the value of this, the company, you all just keep buying it, but you don't know what you're buying. And that's what best of us, and then that's why it's called best of us investors. We're going to make you th three goals. <sighs> make good, sound investment decisions based on fact. Keep more of what you make, holding your assets properly to take advantage of our tax code. And have a goal of accumulating wealth. If that not U.S. government... Tez says that you are allowed to pass $24 million on to your heirs, estate tax free. Then why not do it? Why not do it? If it's estate tax free, do it. And put together a plan so that you, like me, can invest $962,183 on January the 1st, 2021, and end up in on January the 1st, 2022, with $1,704,170, $4, a 100% increase. And I, I know I'm going to beat that because I got 15,000 people today working with me to get it done. So, you want to be a part of our tribe. That's what we call ourselves, us 15,000. Go to bestofusinvestors.com. That's your, our website. 
you'll register there. You'll give me your email address and your name because I want your email address so that I can send you some stuff on a timely basis. I'll then give you the link to the Discord and you can then become part of our tribe. And you can realistically expect that you'll double your money this year. That's what I'm going to do. If I can do it, hell, I'm 76 years old. You got a lot more energy than I do. You can do it too. It's just a matter of making a decision. Do you want it or don't you? Okay, let's get at it. <laughs>